Right, well hopefully this sounds fine. Uh, yeah, we're here in Yakuza 6 in Kamurocho. Back with Kiryu, 48 year old Kazuma Kiryu. And uh, we cannot proceed beyond this point in the trial version, so we need to go into Little Asia, which is looking very snazzy these days, but uh, we, uh, we can't go there. But instead we're just going to wander around town, uh, check out what's on offer in Kamurocho in the start of Yakuza 6. Uh, so the first thing you'll see on the uh, the minimap is, I guess they just added the um, encounter finder, so you can always see where there's danger now. Now I don't know how loud this is going to be. This might be like slightly. Uh, I might turn the gameplay down just a bit uh, after we get out of this fight. The gameplay feels like, I guess we're just getting started. Like I've got no points in anything, but it definitely feels a little slower than Zero, a little more deliberate. Remember this is like a new updated engine from Zero, so... Uh, they kind of removed the, the canned animations of Zero, I guess, uh, in favour of... Uh, in favour of more kind of physics-based... combat. So you see now, like, Kiryu will actually throw punches, like, towards specific parts of the uh, the enemy bodies. Got a bronze plate off that dude. Come on, come at me. Also, guys will run away from you now, which is kind of nice. Alright, we'll turn the volume down slightly because it, it does seem to be louder in uh, in combat, so I'll turn it down a little bit uh, just to be on the safe side. If it's way too quiet, let me know. Um, we're on hard because, I don't know, that felt like the right, the right level. I feel like it doesn't need to be super duper loud. I don't want to like completely remove the volume, but also I don't want to be shouting over it. Uh, so hopefully that'll be fine. But if it's too loud or too quiet, let me know. I'm just going to fight some guys, because I don't really have anything specific to do. I think there are some like side stories and activities we can get into. So we'll try and do that. Uh, so one of the new things they've added, I guess, is they kind of replaced... Um, well, not replaced, but like the, the new heat mode if I hit R2, I go into kind of, it's kind of like beast style. But you get this uh, powered up, uh, you don't flinch, you can kind of just kick through everyone. You get these special attacks. Take out Maruyama here. <laughs> just gonna kick him about. Uh, and that will let you, it will also let you do the, the beast kind of picking up uh, nearby uh, stuff like so you can just push square and he'll pick up stuff and start swinging which is nice we defended ourselves fire hydrant that's a uh, pretty common I think a lot of a lot of major cities in Japan have English on signs so I, I would imagine that none of this is actually translated girls bar raspberry sunshine I don't think we can actually go in here but it looks pretty cool no. Can't go in the girls' bar, Kitty. And buy drinks. Buy a lucky soda. They give you a decent chunk of money uh, off the start. Boost XP, man. Okay, let's get an ultra melon. Man, he really doesn't want to... I was kind of hoping he'd step over that. He does have an animation to step over stuff, but I guess, I guess he didn't want to. So let's get in with this purple jacket guy. Oh, pink man wants uh Oh god, that guy's got a sword. Wow. Okay. We have to be... Uh... We have to be careful about him. So the default grab now, or the, the grab and throw, he really takes everyone out with it. Which is nice. Oh, you get a heat move with the sword now. Jesus. Oh, okay. Kazuma Kiryu has never killed a man. I think it's important that we remember this at all times while uh, while playing this game. 
Yeah, it, it definitely feels a little bit more, uh, I would say realistic, but the way they block stuff, yeah, it kind of, it actually does, it's not just your attack kind of going through them, like it feels your attack actually does bounce off their hands a little bit more, which is nice, a nice touch. Let's just take a cab across the city. Do I have to go round to the, <laughs> have to go round to the actual side of the cab? 7.30 yen, we can do that. Um, just go right. Just cut across town. I'm not too worried about spending money. I'm probably going to start a fresh save when the game actually comes out. Uh, you can carry it over and you can upgrade your stats. So if you're looking to get a little bit of a head start, but like they really don't put much of the story in. Like I think I was able to do one, no, uh, two things maybe after getting to Camarocho, uh, which is after the sort of opening cutscenes. So. You can't do very much, but stats-wise, you can level up your skills, you see here. Um, so each of these level ups costs a certain number, so I need 5 strength and 25 endurance to boost health. Uh, 30 agility for evasion. But then it goes up to 36 for the next level. Um, I'll boost my attack. Uh, I'll boost my defense as well. I'm not too worried about health, because you can just heal back up. Um, you can't buy any of these other things, this boost combo, uh, I can't buy additional sprint, can't buy new heat actions. Uh, I did have a quick look at some of these and there's some, so I can't actually buy this but uh, you can see the video down below, <laughs> it kind of catches the hand in the chopsticks, very nice. Uh, some pretty cool stuff there. Um, oh, the other thing I wanted to show quickly, uh, items. So they split items up now into recovery. Uh, food and drink, and then all your other stuff goes in here, and then I guess valuable items. I, the bronze and iron plates are in here, so uh, that makes me wonder if valuables is specifically for like mission critical stuff. Also, my hunger's at zero of a hundred, which means I should probably eat, right? Um, now I guess that's where the. Um, also, there's cars on the roads now. That's weird. I guess that's where the pocket circuit would have been. I don't know if it's just not there anymore. Uh, that's quite possible. It's been a long time. We're in what 2016 in this game, and Yakuza Kiwami was 2005. So it's been about 10 years of uh, Yakuza action. What is this place? Uh, this was a restaurant, wasn't it? No, no. Let's go upstairs. It sounds like a restaurant. It sounds like they've got like people eating ambiance. Um, so we'll have a wander around and see what we can find. First floor. Oh, oh, okay. This just leads outside again. That's weird. Oh, right. That was just a lift down. <laughs> okay, that makes a lot more sense then. See, it says there is food in here. I guess it's in the back corner. Quadra Garden. Can we go in here? Perfect. So, food now gives you stats, so the sort of stomach meter on the left is 0 of 100. Uh, as that fills up you'll get food, so you see this gives me 5 hunger, this gives me 10 hunger, this gives me 8, the croissant. But it will also give me 7 points of intelligence. Uh, I'm going to call that, I'm going to call those strength, agility, endurance, intelligence, charisma, I guess. I don't know if they have official names, they don't tell you. Uh, smooth tea with creamy milk, and as long as you're uh, as long as you're not filling up, uh, once your stomach fills up, you won't get stat boost anymore. Uh, but it will keep recovering health. So you see, my health is recovering at the top. Uh, let's get a sandwich and uh, some cheesecake, and then I guess if I order a cappuccino now, oh no, my my stomach's not full up. It's just my health. So let's let's get a big old meal for Kiryu here. Milk tea, chocolate cake, toast, sandwich, cheesecake, cappuccino. Full of cake! I got a bonus for eating multiple cake. That's really cool actually, huh? I haven't seen that before. Uh, I've seen some of these mechanics. 
from like open world streams. I haven't seen that. You get a bonus for eating extra, like eating a ton of cake. Um, so let's have a wander around. So theatre square, I guess they flatten this out at some point, huh? That's kind of nice. Uh, I really like seeing how Kamurocho evolves over time. Oh, Yoshi's here. Let's beat him up. Whoa! Mihara with the uh, the big drop kick. Big boy's big drop kick. Someone throw a bicycle at me. So that seems like a really nice way to kind of clean house and get people to drop their weapons, which is nice. Doesn't seem like they'll pick them back up. So this isn't like Breath of the Wild style. Breath of the Wild style. So if I beast now, I should just be able to like pick up this hammer and swing it. I kind of wanted to heat him. There we go. Oh my god! Kiri Kazuma has never killed a man. Again, I want to reiterate that as we slam a hammer through a guy's skull. Hmm. If I let go of the stick, okay, it doesn't actually move the camera back. It was moving the camera back. I wasn't sure. If... There it is. There's the big boy's big steppy. That's what I like. That's what I actually wanted to see. Uh, can we go in here? Looks like we might be able to. Don't be put off by the hanging things. They're actually quite common in, in Japan to kind of keep, I guess, keep some of the light out maybe? I don't really know what the purpose is specifically, but they're quite common on the entryways to restaurants. Get some fried gyoza. You know, I could, yeah, I could go for some fried gyoza. Um, some yakisoba. Maybe some tofu. And, uh, okay, so here we go. Kiryu will be full if he eats any more. So, I'll keep getting health, but I won't get XP or bonuses from menu combinations. Okay. Well, that, that'll do. We'll, we'll, we'll stop there then. We'll just get the, uh, the three. I don't know if the special grants you more or if it's cheaper. I, I haven't, haven't worked that one out yet. So we didn't get any special food combinations there. And I guess hunger just goes down over time or as your um, as you're fighting and stuff. That'll probably deplete your hunger. Uh, so let's have a wander around. Let's pull up the map. So you see the map's changed a little bit, um, but the overall layout is still very much Camarocho. Uh, you know, you've still got Little Asia here, although it's now got this kind of square in the middle. Millennium Tower still dominating presence in the middle. Um, New Serena is still here at the back. Uh, you do visit it very early in the story. Um, which I don't know if... Uh, so, so if... if I guess if you're not familiar with me personally, uh, I've played Zero and Kiwami, but that's all I've actually played in the series. Um, I did think about playing the others, but I want to wait for Kiwami 2, I think, rather than going back to a PS2 game. So I decided to just jump forward, um, and I'll fill in the blanks afterwards. So I'm kind of seeing the beginning and, theoretically, from what they're saying, the end of, of Kiryu's main story arc, and uh, then we'll, we'll catch, catch back up from there. But uh, New Serena... Uh, is run by Mama-san from Yakuza Kiwami who ran a bar kind of over over this way I think she ran like one of the hostess uh, establishments the one that wasn't Shine uh, I think Shine might still be there it is yeah but I think the other one that used to be here uh, that closed down and Mama-san took over New Serena uh, so we go to Club Sega that's pretty close by let's, let's go to Club Sega um, because we can show off Virtua Fighter, I guess. I don't know if any of this stuff will be blocked from streaming. I don't think it is. Uh, traditionally, Yakuza games block the final chapter from being streamed, which... Oh man, I can't go in. Oh, okay, so you can't actually do that. That's a shame. Uh, but yes, you can play Poyo Poyo is in here, as well as uh, Virtua Fighter 5 Final Showdown. So you can do, I think it's arcade mode and versus mode. But you get all the characters, I think, from Virtua Fighter 5. And I had a ton of fun with Virtua Fighter 5, so I'm definitely going to spend a little bit of time playing that in Yakuza 6. I'm just looking for, really, I'm, I'm mostly looking for fights. 
or side activities because that's pretty much what there is to do in this uh, in this demo. Like I say, it seems it does seem pretty limited, uh, which is a shame because the game's not coming out for a while. But that, whoa, jeez, <laughs> he went absolutely flying. Let's see if I can get one of my uh, favorite heat moves off here that I've seen so far. Um, I don't know if I need more heat to do it. I might do. Ah, well, it's fine. So you can do the R2 move, I guess, as soon as you have one heat bar. Uh, but I imagine it will drain faster. You just get to, like, mash out that extra damage. It's kind of like the uh, the rainbow attacks from the cat fighting. If you remember that in Yakuza 0. Okay, so there's an activity down here. Let's go see what that is. I think that might just be darts. Uh, can we go in and do darts? Or will he not let us in because of the where we're at in the story? He might not let us in. That's a shame. There's definitely some uh, side activities. I'm pretty sure you can do karaoke. Karaoke? So uh, we'll take a wander. Just see what we come across. Uh, these locked um, keys you see on the map are these little lock boxes and there are the keys are kind of like the collectibles around town, like the little sparkly collectibles, uh, like the telephone cards were in Zero, or the locker keys in Kiwami. And it seems like maybe they're tied to specific lockers. I don't know. The one I found was right near the locker that it opened, but I don't know if that's just you can use any key on any locker or, or what story is there. Can we go to Club Shine? Maybe we can. I'll try that. I'll see if it'll let me in. Doesn't have an obvious uh, doesn't have an obvious block on it. Someone else with a knife. So this again, this grab, great way to clear out some enemies. It seems like. I I the combat definitely I say feels uh, more deliberate, but I do like the way it feels so far. Oh, he broke the knife. That's how tough Kiryu is. He's trying to stab him and the knife just shatters. Man, they're eating through my health. This guy's got a lot of health as well. I should heal up. Uh, so this works the same as before. You can just toughness back up. Not really too much of a problem there. I want to slam this guy into the car, really. Give him some of that. Takes up a decent chunk of health. I am playing on hard, so... I imagine that changes health or the damage you deal, because it did in past games. Wow. Couldn't block that. Which I guess is fair. I wonder if the evasion stat changed your distance, or just the speed it, that you evade at. No charge, no tax. Wow, pizza. No Wait. Pizza, 600 yen. Okay. No charge. I don't know what no charge means. Maybe that's like a... That's another way of saying tax. So you can actually go around in first person now, and you can run in first person, which is kind of fun. Uh, if you interact with anything, it takes you out, but it's a pretty neat little feature. Wander around Kamurocho in first person. Oh, there we go. Not available. Disappointing. It is quite limited, but that's fine. Uh, I just wanted to have a wander around. Uh, I know that the demo is huge. It's like 36 gig. It's the size of the full game, which I guess you have to install the full game anyway, so you need to make that space on your hard drive. Um, but it's still a lot to download if you have slow internet. So I figured, you know, if you want to see a bit of it, you can watch me play it badly. Let's grab E-Day here, give him a... Big old big swing. So you see, people just kind of bounce off you when you're in super heat mode. I want to grab this guy and give him the big heat. Oh, I didn't quite get him. There we go. He'll kick to the dick. 
The Majima special. Uh, we've earned a thousand XP. Great. Okay, so we can level up, uh, probably. I'm just going to keep leveling up because I, I don't have anything else to do with these points, I don't think. Um... Boost attack. It's just going to make the fights even shorter, which I, I don't know if that's a good thing or not, but... Okay. And we'll put some health in. Ooh, I ranked my stats up. Nice. I wonder if she'll react to the photo. So I noticed some people will react. Oh, sorry. Maybe not if I bump into them. But some people will react if you uh, if you take a photo of yourself. They'll uh, try and get in on it. She kind of hit behind me, which is weird. Where are they? Oh, they're there. So yeah, some, some people will kind of hide themselves from the camera. Some people will pose for the camera. Which is a nice little touch. That guy's dropped something on the floor. We'll find out what it is. Iron plate. Oh, a toughness Z. Fantastic. Well, I did need one of those, so that's good. What's down here? Is it still a popo on the corner here, or is it something else? It is still a popo. You can just walk into shops now. Another nice touch. You don't have to wait for them to load. Uh... We get a fresh lettuce sandwich, about as filling as you might expect. A couple of gold pizza buns. A sushi set. Uh, and we'll get a couple of Toriners to replace the ones that we already had. We'll probably run out of money. Because <laughs> I'm just spending frivolously. And I don't think you... I don't know how you get money in this game. Because you don't get it from most combat encounters. I don't know if you just get it from selling the plates that people drop. Uh, is the uh, yeah the pawn shop is still here? So I'll pop to Ibisu Pawn and we'll we'll see what it is. You can go into Don Quixote if you want. Check out the the B had. Nice to hear they haven't changed the uh, Don Quixote theme tune in 30 years. I don't. I imagine that's still true of the real Don Quixote. I imagine that's still their theme song. Otherwise, why have it in here? Sliding doors. Is sliding doors a common thing in Japan? Like manually sliding doors? I don't know. I'm here to sell. I'm also here to buy, but we'll tell you about that in a minute. Uh, okay. Oh, so here you go. Bronze plate is a thousand. I don't know how many I have. Oh, I have no more to sell. Okay. So I have two. Okay. So bronze plates are worth more than iron. I guess that makes sense. Appstim half. Uh, mm, 15 grand. Like, I don't really care about lowering my hunger gauge. I'll just take the money. Um, and then we sell. Arigato. Arigato. Oh, I should, I should see what they have, seeing as we're here. Look at these sweet trophies. It's like the sports teams like selling off their awards or something. Uh, Suzaku Brace... Oh, this stuff is expensive. Um, 25 Attack. Oh, I like this song. Funky. Increases digestion by 10%, increases XP gain by 10%. So I imagine that means your hunger goes down 10% faster, and your XP goes up. Oh, interesting. So that actually... So it's like heavy training weight. It's like you actually lose stats but gain XP. Mm. I'd be tempted to buy that, but I don't know that it's actually particularly useful. Um, gemstone bracelet engraved with an image of Seru. Bulletproof vest. Charismatic photo. Makes enemies more likely to confront you. Boomerang briefs fills you with fighting spirit. Very nice. Um, I contemplate buying something, but I did just remember... Um, so the equip screen's at the end of the stats here. Uh, I got this Morning Glory waistband for having passed Yakuza data. But I also got this rusted chainmail. Restricts movement. Uh, it takes your evasion down. Eh, I don't want that. 
Okay, well maybe I'll buy a charismatic photo or something. Uh, does it give you? Oh, it gives you more heat. Uh, sure. Let's spend all our money on a charismatic photo. This is uh, this is in past games as well. Um, lets you makes people more likely to challenge you, which is fine because you know all we're doing is being here to fight. I wouldn't actually use it in the main game because generally speaking, I don't want to just fight people all the time. Like I don't like the items that reduce the amount of encounters because I do like fighting people. Um, But, you know, I don't, I don't want to be fighting people constantly. And get this motorbike if we... There we go. Whoa! Stuff is really bouncy in this game. You. So when that cutscene plays out, you actually want to... Uh... When the mash square cutscene plays, you want to stop mashing square. There's a pro tip for you. Because it's going to go into that quick time event. And if you're mashing square, you're going to miss all the quick time events. Because it doesn't constantly tell you to press square. I like the new, whoa, I like that uh, video billboard on the Camaroo Theatre, that's nice. Should be another Club Sega here, but I'm guessing, yeah, we can't go in there either. What's here? What's this place? Looks like they're not going to follow me inside. Okay, well that's good. I think this might be karaoke. Let's find out. We're getting a room something. Just turn up like, do you want a room? Yeah, yeah, sure. W what is it? Okay, it is karaoke. Good. Um, right. Let's let's sing. Let's start with the first song. Oh, this isn't one where we're singing. This is a backup one. Let's do a passionate backup. I love a passionate backup. I'm probably not going to talk over the top of this because it's hard to talk and play. So you can just enjoy the music. I love hearing Kiryu sing. It's beautiful. Chibi. I, it's, I don't know how... Is he just so famous they have a chibi version of him on, on everything he does? 87. That's alright. I'll take it. I'll take it. Uh, we can sing again. I'm just going to go through him. For now, I think I think like a butterfly might be the one with the heavy lyrics. We'll see. Thank you. 
Oops. I need to learn the difference between the holds and the presses. I really like that song. I really enjoy that. I want to sing that. Take me to Camarocho. It's a beautiful song. Uh-oh. Our time's up. Let's keep going. I want to try some more songs. Can we actually... Okay, we can't do anything else. Uh, I wondered if there were like more settings, cause, but you can't actually change the stuff up the top, so... Uh, let's go on to... Today is a diamond. Let's actually have... Uh, this is the song I've heard the most. One with Kiryu actually singing. Enjoy his beautiful dulcet tones. Beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. Love it. Fantastic. Very good. Kid you. I really like the, uh, the, the crowd waving their glow sticks. It's a nice touch. He's the idol in all of our hearts. Damn, seventh. Not bad. I'll take that. I feel like... So that's the song I've heard the most, and I think the uh, the karaoke in uh, Yakuza is always easier when you've heard it a few times because it's timed to the music so it's a little easier to follow when you uh, when you know the song quite well also ones that you sing are easier than ones that you're accompanying on for the same reason because you're actually in time to the music whereas sometimes these accompaniments are like off beat.
So the pink ones are rapid press, the blue ones are hold. So that's, uh, if you want a, another hot pro tip, blue for hold, pink for rapid press. Uh, I, those colours are probably, I was going to say hopefully you're not colour blind, but I don't think blue and pink is a very common one, so hopefully that's okay. Bum ba ba da da bum. Oh, one off the nicest ranking. Out of time again. Man, there's only one more song. Why would you have why would you have five songs? That's where they get you, right? Because you want to sing all five songs. But then you've uh you've paid for six, right? Alright, let's hear let's hear that those dulcet tones one more time. Coming to the stage, Kazuma, Kiryu! Nishki. Could I? It is hella gay, and I also approve. Oh man, Kazuma. It's beautiful. Wiping the tears away. There's that classic photo. Ah, memories, eh? Good times. That's a sick dance move he's got there. Just a little point. Hell yeah! Look at those bonus points I got. Uh, right, let's just sing one of these again, I guess. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna sing this one again, because it's rocking. And I didn't do it very well.
Ah. I think this is definitely one where you need to know the song pretty well because it's a lot of it's quite offbeat. Syncopated Kiryu. Oh yeah. Uh, right, well, that's enough karaoke for now. Let's, uh, let's move it on. See what else is going on. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Alright, fine, fine. So, you've been in this room for an hour and a half. Please, please let the other customers have a turn. I wonder if those guys will still be waiting outside for me. No, they've moved on. Man, there's multiple big cones now. Stepping it up. Um, I don't know what else there is to do, to be honest. Uh, I wonder if we can get to the Mahjong. Because, you know, that's what everyone wants to see. I bet it's closed off, because I think most of the uh, side stuff seems to be closed off. So, Actually, no, we might not even be able to get in, because wasn't it by the sexy club? That's where I go for my mahjong. To the sexy club. Um, it looks like that might be our only way in. I know that does open up after you get through this next scene, because I have seen people playing past this next scene in previews, but sadly, for now... Uh, I guess we could go to Rise Up. I don't know if Rise Up is open, but we could try it. What's up here? The batting centre, right? Mm -hmm. Something's changed. Something's very much stay the same. Oh, there's a Mahjong thing here. Oh, no, it was... I think it was closed, right? Because I think I went in to the cafe, but not the Mahjong. All right. Well, you know what Mahjong looks like. I don't imagine it's that much different in Yakuza 6. Oh, man, you really... So, not only do you not have much stamina, but you don't actually get as much of a warning as you do in Zero, that he's about to run out. Hello. Oh, they're here. Yo, check out Sato's down there. He's a big boy. Oh my. Get this sword out of the way. I can hear someone like clattering about on bicycles over there. Alright. That's enough with these guys. Parlor, lucky. Uh, we should probably eat. It's been a while since we ate. Now that you had kind of have now that food is kind of not necessarily tied purely to hunger, or not tied purely to health but also to hunger. I feel like we should eat more often. Yeah, look at that, we've emptied out again already. Let's get some uh, vegetable champ on. Some fried rice. A bit of gyoza. And some veggie filled soup. That'll do. See if we get any meal combinations. It's Nope, no meal combinations, never mind. That's a nice hat. I like that. Goes with the uh goes with the outfit. Very nice. Very stylish. Uh, I was gonna go over to Rezap and see if that's open or not. I'm gonna guess it probably won't be because it's like a, a full on side story, but I guess we'll see. That guy was definitely about to give me the hammer. Kiru Kazuma has never killed a man. Oh man, one Atabe. Oh, I 
terror. Wow. Oh, I was gonna say I'm getting a lot of encounters, but I forgot that I put the encounter increasing item on. So these guys will just kind of follow you everywhere, and you can get into a fight wherever you want. <laughs> just... All right, I've got time for a fight. Wakabayashi there. That's a good name. I kind of want to get where there's more stuff to hit. So that when I heat up, there'll actually be something to do with it. Wow. Getting battered by Kihara here. Alright, let's bring her over to the bikes and then we can uh, give him the beast mode. Okay, so the, you see the, the meter in the left is kind of... ...giving us the, the charge down as we use it up. That's pretty cool. I, I do like that. I, I... Oh, that's just straight up 30 grand. Okay, so you do kind of get money from fights straight up. Who carries a comedy mallet about the streets of Tokyo? That's a fair question. <laughs> Um, let's hope it was a comedy mallet, because otherwise that's uh, it's going to do him no end of... Uh, I'm just... Uh, this is the thing, is now they've added this, I'm never going to run round stuff. I'm always just going to, like, go over stuff, because it's so much more fun. And they're not heat-specific finishing moves. Uh, so there are, like, you can still do standard heat moves. Um, oh, I guess you can do the rise-up stuff. There is still standard heat stuff, um, but there's also... Uh, you can hit R2 to go into that. It's basically more like beast mode. Um, so you just spend heat on all your attacks and you don't flinch when you get hit. Um, and then once you're attacking in that, you'll go into like those chain heat moves where specific strikes will give you, have you like do a little quick time event. I have seen fewer heat moves, but also worth noting like you don't have very many unlocked. Uh, you can unlock more heat moves in the menu and you can't actually unlock them in the demo. So, I think a lot of the more situational ones, there's ones like, hey, grab a guy and then move towards another guy and do triangle. I don't know this dude, but apparently he's like the face of Rise App in Japan. Like he's, he's a famous dude. ありました。本来は電話なので予約していただくんですが、大丈夫です。どうぞこちらへ。ああ。こちらが受付になります。ああ、悪いな。Again <笑> I like the idea that Kiryu has never been to a gym before. Maybe Ichimi is his first time here, but he's just naturally that buff. That's what being in the Yakuza will do for you. It's a nice pen holder. Yeah, but you know the counseling is going to make you feel like you have to join, right, Kiryu? That's how it works. They guilt you into it. <laughs> Remember San Andreas? Yeah, I loved all the, the gym and the fast food stuff in San Andreas. Um, like, I spent quite a long time, when, when you first unlock that, I would just like, cycle to the gym, do a workout, go get some, go get like a big burger and a salad and stuff. It was a good time. I kind of miss that they took a lot of that stuff out. Like, you can go to the gym in later, I think in 5 you can do like gym stuff and you can obviously go and get food, but... I appreciate that Yakuza still got all the, uh... Uh, abilities to kind of go in and just pick out what you want at the restaurant and stuff. 
Also, so they've actually integrated some of that in here. So, like, I think you, uh, when you've done a workout, you actually have to eat a specific meal to kind of get the most benefit from it. Free diet advice, there we go. Damn, they do training and they plan meals? え、like he's obviously quite in shape, but he's not like hugely ripped or, or you know, he's not this massive stacked dude like the guy at the entrance was. He's just kind of, you know, he's fit, he's healthy. He's toned. <laughs> well, let me tell you something, brother. <laughs> Man, show me those 24 inch pythons. That's what it's all about. What you gonna do when Kiryu Kazumo runs wild on you? Oh. Kiryu's constantly amazed at everything, which I appreciate. He's, he's got an innocent charm to him, even after... 28 years of being in the Yakuza, or being in and out of the Yakuza, I guess. Let's become a member. See? That's that's where they get you. That consultation. It's just a snare. I wonder if we actually have to pay. In case you forgot from five seconds ago, I'm your trainer. I guess maybe you could walk away, right? <laughs> there will be a lot of racism, yes. <laughs> hmm. Wow. Nice. He was enthusiastic about that. I like the idea here, just come whenever you feel like it. Like, you know, no specific days. I just come along. Just hang out. It's actually very laid back, this whole thing. I'm going to be terrible at this because it's timing based. But we'll see. I think some of them are mashy. Okay, good. Let's get to training. Let's get sweaty. Is that that's a direct uh, Shenmue reference right there? Let's get sweaty. Perfect. Um, I'm ready. Let's start training. If you're gonna do it, do it right, right. Do it with me. Oh, check out that sweet grey tea. Let's do some jump squats. Hell yeah. Alright. I wonder if they provide the clothing. Okay, I can press triangle to jump squat, circle to jump squat, X to jump squat, or square to jump squat. View rules. Oh, interesting. So you have to time it with the ring. That is actually quite useful. Oh, okay. So it is multiple buttons. Okay, that does make sense. I don't, I don't just pick, just hit whatever. Okay. So it's kind of like the disco mini game from uh, Zero. Oh, I went too late on that one. <laughs> just very lazy. 
I'm going too early on that first one. Maybe I'm not going too early, I don't know. That was terrible. Sorry, Kiri. Let you down there. Alright, what do we do next? Um, I still kind of want... Uh, I'm going to do the seated row. Because I, I like the... Uh, I want to increase my evasion. And that's the, the blue agility stat. Hold to increase gauge, release to stop gauge. So, okay, so this is the timing one. Ah. So it gets a little bit smaller each time you're successful. Because you kind of get more tired. Ah. You can't stop me mid mid rep. What's that about? Okay, well, that wasn't too bad. Got an A probably overall. No slacking. Gotcha. Good. <laughs> Some good specific advice. That's what I like. It's like, don't worry, we've got a diet plan. Here's the diet plan. You should eat healthily. <laughs> but that would be far too easy. Okay. On the plus side, hopefully, like, finding the healthiest option should be pretty easy. What if I go to, like, um, Smile Burger? <laughs> oh, this was the healthiest thing they had, was the, the quarter pounder and chips. I got an apple pie slice, because, you know, fruit. Ah, dropping hints, nice. That's what I like to hear. I don't think there's any New Japan representation in this demo, sadly, because I the that stuff's all tied to the clan creator, and I don't think that comes up until I actually don't know when it comes up, but uh, it's it's it happens over the course of the story. Um, I want to say it's actually like probably quite late because I heard I think. It, I watched Giant Bomb's video and I think Alex said it happens after you come back from Onomichi and you don't go to Onomichi till like chapter 4 so okay Makuta here's your meal plan I'll let you have some popper, popular yakiniku you can't go wrong with meat after a workout okay I don't know where I would get that but uh, we'll find somewhere we will find somewhere. Do 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 do. So yeah, sadly no New Japan representation in the demo, I don't think. Um, but I've seen some of those character models and they're real good. Um, I didn't sort of delve too much into it because yeah, I didn't want to didn't want to spoil too much of that that stuff. But uh, it's it's really <laughs> it's a pachinko big attack. I missed that. It's called like volcanic volcano. Um, yeah, the having them like not actually be wrestlers but still use their real names is real, real wild. Okay, so I think each of these circle things is a standard heat move, uh, but like I don't currently have a heat move for like grabbing a guy. I don't think there's like a. At least at the moment, I don't have a straight standing heat attack. But then I guess. Majima didn't have a standing heat attack in, uh, not like a grab heat attack in Zero. You had to be near a wall, so maybe it's a little bit more like that. Um, let's just wander down. Actually, there's food stuff here. Let's uh, see if we can't get. Um, yeah, you're not going to have it, are you? No. There's a, uh, the beef place is like over here, right? Let's see if I can go in here. Ooh. I like that they show you roughly where they're coming from. 
he says, not being able to see where they're coming from. Oh wow, they're actually coming out of the theatre. <laughs> Just like hanging out watching a movie and they're like, yo, let's let's get in and fight this guy. Multiple knives here. Okay, so if I pick up a knife, I can get the, the sweet knife heat attack. Stab this dude and then give him the... Oh my god. Kazuma Kiryu has never killed a man. Death Horn! Whoa, I just punched all three of them. That's incredible. Yeah, in fact, I would run away as well, dude. Don't worry. Just trash the place up. Multi kill, kill, kill. Yeah. That's not. Mm. It's not what he asked me to get. What did he ask me to get? I don't even remember anymore. Yakiniku. I don't even know where I would begin to get that. Let's have a look around, see what we got. Wete Kitchen. Wild Jackson. Let's check out some of these places. Wild Jackson Buffalo Wings, huh? That does sound good, but it's probably not going to have what we're looking for. No, although a wild chicken sandwich does sound pretty good. I'm going to level up my stats and probably do that, right? Yeah, so if you go in here, you see in the heat actions, like, increase your rush combo, uh, boost your heat damage. There's heat actions, like, once you get down here, and there's other skills. I think it's, I think it might be in here somewhere. Yeah, so you can get um, specific, uh, grab, grab an enemy and press triangle near another enemy. Um... One enemy in a chokehold, press triangle near another. So I guess uh, once you unlock those, you'll be able to do heat actions a little bit more freely versus when you have, I specifically when you have items pulled out. Can I even go in here? Because it's uh, blocked off. Oh man, can we do live chat? I'm actually not going to do live chat. Um, I think you can. I, people have streamed live chat on Twitch. Uh, kind of, yeah. It, but it's like it's it's into the um, it's like into the neck breaker. It's real vicious. Uh, I'll pull it up again, just quickly, because I know the one you were talking about. Um, so he trips this one guy up and stomps on him, and then like he actually does like the neck breaker off the top, which doesn't really slam it on top of them, but it is pretty impressive. The one I actually really like is uh, chopstick mastery here. So grabs his hand in the chops. I don't know where you get. Well, actually, so you can just go into buildings like mid-fight now because there's th this one here is. He just like throws him into a microwave. He's like, do it. And he just murders him with a microwave. And firstly, I'm actually not sure that would work for a multitude of reasons, but also it's vicious. Uh, so this this is the live chat, which I, I'm just going to skip over it. Uh, for now. Um, this guy is upset that uh, that he's been spending all his time on live chat. Kiryu doesn't know what live chat is. And so he invites you to come along. Live chat is a room full of kittens. Oh, a cat room, not a chat. A chat room, not a cat room. I thought it was French. Chat room. Damn. Sounds all right. Ooh, the really good stuff. I want the really good stuff. It's <laughs> a good read. So I, I wonder if they actually have this I presume this means that you can just do it in the demo um, Live chats I'm not going to stream it Although I think you can stream it Like it's, There's no actual nudity But it, it's pretty intense The girls um, they, uh, they get pretty full on I'll say that 
Uh, I recommend going and watching Waypoint's uh, second stream of Yakuza 6 if you want to see some live chat in action. Because it's really something. Some fantastic online handles uh, from the people in the live chat. You can meet Uncle Dicky and 30-year-old uh, virgin. Um, right, where else are there food places? Quadra Garden. Smile Burger. What's up here? Maybe we should go to like a steak joint. Canrai is still Canrai. Yes, let's go up towards the steak houses. Hot Wheels Master City. I wish Hot Wheels Master To be honest, if, if they were... I wouldn't actually have been surprised if there was someone in there called Hot Wheels Master 69. Club... Oh, I want to go to Club Dunk. Take me to Club Dunk. Damn. Forget about live chat. Oh, give me that baseball bat. Hell yeah. <laughs> Just punched him out of existence. I'm sad you can't. So you can't go into Club Sega in this either. So you can't play Virtua Fighter or Poyo Poyo. But that would be nice. I have to wait for the full game on that one. It is kind of like a big comedy hammer, isn't it? <laughs> I spy a lot of bikes. Whoa. Wow, I just caught him in the liver. Rough times. Um, fantastic romance. Whereabouts are we? Okay, I want to swing this way. This is the thing is like the layout is still the same because it's been a while. Like I, I, I like at a glance, I'm not immediately familiar with where I am in town. Like I can kind of recognize the shape. Uh, and once I know where I am, no, once I know where I'm starting, I can work my way around. But like by default, I don't immediately like know where I'm at. Nice. That hair is looking so good. Also, so if you um, if you take a screenshot, uh, if you take a uh, sorry, if you take a photo, it uh, immediately saves to um, your screenshots on the PS4, which is a nice touch. Uh, I can't go up there. Is that where I want? Oh no, I actually wanted to go up here. Check out the steakhouse. See if uh, see if they've got what we're looking for. Oh, can I not get to this? Oh, no, I can. Okay, we're good. Check out this guy's hat. Check out this guy's hat. That is a good chef hat. Oh man, I want a steak. I'm track, trying to track down this specific meal. I wish you told me where you could get it. Man, more, more, uh, more blades. <laughs> this is I'm just beeping a horn at everyone like all oh, the yakas are fighting in the street. Whoa, careful kitty. Jesus.
So he doesn't dash very far, and I imagine that you'll be able to get, once you get skills that boost that, it'll be a little bit easier. But he moves such a short distance by default. Which is kind of a shame, because I feel like... I understand why they don't let you upgrade that stuff in the demo, but also... <clears throat> It means that people aren't people who aren't as familiar with the series are going to get a pretty like uninteresting, um, pretty sort of uninteresting look on the uh, on the combat of the series, which is a shame because I feel like it is kind of a strong point. I'm going to have to heal again. Yeah, can you get Korean barbecue? Okay. Well, thanks for the heads up. Kanrai, I think, is... Kanrai might be Korean barbecue. Um, so I'll, ch I'll check there. They certainly have, like, um, Bibimbap, I think. Or well, they did in Zero, so... We might be in luck. Wow. They really do go flying, which I appreciate. Beautiful. Camera is just over here, so... We'll, we'll try. If, it, if it's not in there, then... Actually, what I'll do is location list... Where's this place? Okay. Oh wow, they changed the out of outside of uh where you go in Okay, no, you do still go in here, okay. It's just so far back that I didn't realise. This is interesting as well because like you didn't just walk in off the street to a lot of these places, so you wouldn't necessarily see the entryways like you do now. Hmm. Okay, no, they don't have it here either. I don't think. Get some tripe barbecue though. Check out, uh, check out the luxury seats. Luxury seats is like the best name for uh, a host club thing I've ever seen. You can actually get some good angle on uh, on this. Wolfman, freshness. Oh, can you just get a taxi here? Oh my god, that's incredible. Let's get a taxi on the fly. Next gen, truly. Oh, I can't even go here. Well, why you got to do this to me? Can I even get round to that place? I was going to try it, see if that made any difference. I'm not honestly convinced that it will. It might not be what we're looking for. I feel like if it wasn't something that was specifically labelled as what they asked, then they would have like localised it. And the fact that they didn't kind of suggests because they don't localise most of the food names, so I figured maybe they uh, like if it's not. If they haven't changed the food name, it's because it's called that on the menu. But who knows? If not, I'll just get something that's meaty, because he did just say get meat. Wow. These guys all have bats.
Now I am the one who has the bat. I do appreciate not having to load into battles anymore. That's certainly a nice touch. I wonder how it handles that from like a tech perspective. Uh, I want the first one, right? The second one, Sushi Jin. This is really cool. I, 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 but even just being able to walk in and out of places is really nice. Um, uh, well, we're just going to get something from here, I guess. I guess. Even, actually, they don't, I don't even know if they have... No, this is all fish, isn't it? Uh, what's the skewer platter? Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe I get the bib and bap. Or something like that. Ooh, there's a fight here. So you can get a heat move against the car, I think. He says, you can, you just have to line it up right. Okay. Give old Deathhorn the, the car slam. There's a Sega. Still got awards for defeating Sega. It's actually weird because in Zero, like, after because the fights were in a specific arena, after they took place, you would kind of, um, you would drop out of like everything would have reset. So the fact that that kind of doesn't happen now is weird because like all the stuff's still broken on the floor. I should probably eat. Uh, not eat. I should probably uh, use a health item. Oh, oh. This, is, oh, this is Smile Burger, isn't it? Maybe I should just get a Smile Burger. Maybe I should bring... I'm going to try and bring a fight into Smile Burger. Get inside. Come in. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> Wanton destruction of property. That's what I'm all about. Sorry about that. Oh wow, okay. Good, very good. I appreciate that. I appreciate that they don't serve you. I thought she was just going to give me food for a second there. And I was like, well, that's very generous. It seems like if they haven't aggroed, they will de-aggro when you walk out, when you walk into a store. Um, I guess some curry rice. Sounds all right. Bam, 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 bam. I do like the music they pull when uh, thugs are coming after you. Wow, okay. Gave that guy a new scar. Whoa, that dude just kicked an entire motorbike through me. Vicious. It 
So it seems like they have added like that tiny little bit of, uh, I guess, downtime. Check out this dude. I think he's just a statue, but uh, he's pretty cool. Oh, this is a sushi shop. That sound, does sound good though. Fatty tuna. Ah. Oh, we get some fatty tuna. Uh, there isn't much else to do. I could go do live chat. Um, but uh, I, oh, I want to leave. I want to leave something in the demo for people to try it for themselves. And also, it is quite spicy. Um, so, just in case anyone's watching at work, I'll uh, I'll let you discover that on your own time. I do wish you could sprint it, but so now the default speed is like uh, walking. So if you actually want to go fast, you have to hold down the sprint button, and you can't upgrade your stamina in the uh, in the beta. So it's a lot of just oh man, I can really upgrade. Shaboom! 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 This is great. This is some good, some good upgrades. Okay, we're out. I don't really bother with health because it kind of feels a bit pointless because I don't know the way I always look at it is like if you're upgrading health um, versus just normally I guess so you don't use money to upgrade in this game so it's not sure it's a big deal but like you can just. Um, Whoa. Um, so you can just buy health items pretty um, pretty cheaply in these games. So I don't really see that much of a point in upgrading your health. Um, I'm interested to see... Oh, okay. I was going to see if they stacked, but I, uh, I didn't buy enough and I can't be bothered to go back. But I do really like that they split out your item stuff now. Okay, I can't go any further that way. Let's go north. Also, you can cut through here now, which is nice. So you can actually get out the other side of the uh, parking lot. It seems like if you get a perfect dodge, you do kind of like cut around people a bit more. Whereas, like by default, your your dodge goes like a very very short distance. This guy actually doesn't look like he really wants to fight, and I don't really blame him. But okay, so that's kind of the same whichever part of the car you're on, I think. Just seeing if there's anything else we haven't used yet. Can heat. Okay, nothing weird about the can heat, you just kind of slam it into them. So yeah, you don't have to run right around the outside of that place to get out now. Which is a nice bonus, I guess. Oh, this is where camera is anyway. I'm just going to get some like bath or something and see if... Seeing as I can't find anything else that's specific. We just get some. Hmm. I think you can hit square to remove something if you add it and then don't want it. Oh, maybe not. Maybe you just have to. Um. And yeah, we'll get some. He didn't say you couldn't have multiple. I'm gonna order one thing, and then I'll uh, order some more afterwards. So you see, he takes a picture. And he's like, yeah, oh I took God. I took a picture of my food. And then you can send it to the trainer. Uh, but we'll get some more food while we're here. <laughs> yeah, I know I was just here, but look, I want some salted tongue. And uh, what else we got here? Get some kimchi. Some grilled garlic. 
on the side and a special salad. Also, you get specific, so I found this earlier when I ordered a lot of cake. You'll get specific uh, food bonuses if you order, like, uh, certain combos of food. Which is a nice, like, additional touch. We get a text. You finished the Rise App Challenge. Please stop by whenever you have a chance. Okay. We'll send him a sticker. He doesn't really respond to stuff. Uh, Makuta. I think Makuta, your trainer? Well, that works. Also, I got 20 grand. So that's the thing, is like when you do get money, you seem to get a decent chunk of it. So although it's a little bit random, you can make money just from fighting guys. There's another 20 grand from presumably someone I fought a minute ago and didn't quite catch. Men's entertainment box. I wonder if this is um, still the same thing as it was before. Yeah, it is. Okay, so this is just like... Oh, hey, we'll tell you about the host clubs and the hostess club. Well, I guess the hostess clubs because it's a men's entertainment box, but, you know. I guess that's still a thing. Gym's down where the uh, bowling centre used to be, so no bowling in this, I don't think. Unless there's something on Amichi, but... We'll let these guys catch up to us. But we'll stand over by this bicycle. Or this scooter, I guess. What might go as a can? Wow, the way their eyes roll back in their head is like real vicious. There's something about those close-ups that, like, they, they don't seem like they should be that um, vicious, but the facial expressions on them really make it. Also, yeah, not having this street, specifically this street, be filled with people is really weird. I'm kind of not used to it, but... See, there is still a bowling-like sign. But I, I'm pretty sure there's not actually bowling here anymore. Um... Yeah, see, so you, they de-aggro as soon as you go inside, unless you're already fighting. I wonder what happens if you bring people in the gym to fight, if he helps you out. Oh, I should have had the harami. Why didn't you tell me that? Oh, dear. Part of the diaphragm is considered awful. Okay. So they, they don't give you the exact answers there, so I guess... Unch, 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 unch. That's fucking great. We got a B. Made some gains. Look at that tat. Look at that high definition dragon. Yeah. Oh, that's so good. Cool. Thanks very much. Okay, so we did some karaoke. We did some gym training. And uh, we encountered the live chat. Oh, actually, yeah, okay, this is a nice thing to do before we leave. This is one for series fans. So this is a returning character. Although Kiryu maybe doesn't remember too well. 
He's seen a lot of people over his time. So from my understanding, this guy will kind of like, not exactly Mr. Shakedown, but he'll turn up at random points and spar with you. Oh, and in that case, you know Tiger Saijima. Then we call. Oh, no. Those pants, man. Those trousers. Hell yeah. It's a good look. Real deep crotch on those. Kiryu just looks tired, which I guess is perhaps because he's old and he's been in prison for three years and... Okay, so this guy's doing pretty well for himself. <笑>あ、Living that Kamarocho lifestyle, Sodachi. Shining example of buffness. He's the stuff. Ah, uh, poor Sadachi, intimidated by the dragon of Dojima. <laughs> Bring it on, buddy. <laughs> His expressions are really good. I really like this dude. So I haven't seen this guy because I say like I I haven't yet played the intersecting sort of two to five, and I think he shows up around four or five. So uh, I'm not too familiar with him, but I want to get to know him now. So uh, I'm looking forward to meeting him in the past and in the future in Yakuza Six. どれだけ近づけたのかをね。ああ、ちょっとちょっと帰らないで。面倒くせえな。悪いが、そんなのに付き合う暇はないんでな。ああ、キリ。いいもん、いいもん。あら。Oh man, this You know, I wasn't I wasn't in initially certain about the music in 6, but it's got some real good beats. That was... That was not too challenging. No, you don't, my friend. But yeah, I think he'll just keep showing up over time and he'll get stronger and stronger. Kind of like how Mr. Shakedown does, but he starts from a much lower bar. Good life lesson there. I'm going to practice extra hard so I can make use of those sweet muscles. <laughs> Hang on a second. I'm going to start doing that, like, right before I have dinner or something. Just a little clap and the surf wiggle. I like that they busted some, uh, they busted, like, some, uh, the animations out of, uh, uh, out of zero for him.
Beautiful. Well, um, I think that's kind of about everything. I say I could go do live chat. I can't play Mahjong. I can't go to Club Sega. Uh, I've done quite a lot of karaoke. Uh, I've been to the Nyan Nyan Cafe. Um, so yeah, I think that's kind of it. Uh, so I'll do a couple more fights and then I'll, I'll wrap things up. But hopefully, uh, if you know, if you're waiting for your down for your 36 gig download to happen, uh, this is giving you something to enjoy in the meantime. Or if you just, just don't have the space to download it, remember that the full game is also going to be about the same size, about 36, 37 gigabytes. So you've got until April to make the space. I really want to get that sword off that dude. Where did he go? Oh, he's there. Mizuno with the sword. I was hoping I'd pick him out, but... Okay, now I've got the sword. So they've actually added heat modes to the sword now, whereas before, swords didn't have heat. I'll say it one last time. Kazuma Kiryu has never killed a man. But it's not for want of trying at this point. Give it one more big steppy. Hell yeah. I really like that. Every opportunity to do that. I'm going to take advantage of it. Let's take a photo. Let's take a photo of these ladies. See if they mind. People seem to react to uh, being in photos. Which is fun. But they don't care. I think if they're already doing something, maybe they won't react. But uh, if they're if they're active, or so if they're if they're like not actively doing something, you'll see them uh, react specifically to uh, you taking pictures of them, which is nice. Some of them will pose, some of them will hide from the camera. It's a nice little touch. Can we go in here? I guess we can, right? Does this should go into the Millennium Tower? Wait, what did... I'm going to have to have a look at that in a sec. So I'm going to buy a load of cake. And a load of sandwiches. And a cappuccino. And an espresso. Because this will show off some of the... Hopefully this will show off like the food benefit thing. Okay, it didn't. Maybe you can only get it on specific times. But yeah, there's... There's basically a, a bonus for eating like certain foods together, I guess. Now I've got to find my way out of here. There we go. Hmm. Let's go find a random person who we can take a photo with. Maybe this lady. Maybe she'll. Uh, she's not doing anything. Ma'am. No. Disappointing. I had so many good reactions when I first pulled the camera out. I was kind of hoping I'd uh, get a few more. Wow, they really, like... The, I wasn't even in view of those guys, but they were ready to go. I don't think you just hear them, like, smashing stuff up in the background. I'm still kind of torn on this uh, extreme heat mode, but I imagine like they'll add more stuff to it over time and that will make it more interesting. It's okay. Uh, I feel like I kind of preferred the canned heat moves, but um, I guess they did kind of start to get a bit repetitive over time, so... This does mix it up a little bit more. Get off. Yeah. 
I get surrounded, Kitty. This guy reacted. Hey, buddy. I suppose. All right, that's Yakuza 6. Um, I guess I'll wrap it up there. Um, I'm gonna take a photo with this lady. Oh, she is not paying any attention. I'm disappointed in that. I definitely got some, uh... Boop. That's the kind of photo Ka uh, Kazuma Kiru would take. Real dad photo. She's like trying to work out how his camera works. Wow, getting heat- getting beast heated. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Yeah, so enemies do block a lot. I don't know if that's because I'm on hard or if that's just generally enemies block a lot more in this game. I do wish they, they let you see a little bit more of the combat because it definitely opens up as you unlock skills. The fact you can't unlock any skills in the demo is uh, a shame, but I guess you've got to save some stuff for the real game. Like, they don't want you to unlock the whole tree before you even get started because you can't carry a save over if you want to. Wow, I went to heat with that. There we go. Superman punch. And we'll wrap it up there. Thanks for coming by. Yeah, that was good fun. Um, that's Yakuza 6. The game is out April the 17th, I want to say. The demo's live now. I say it's 36 and a half gig or something. So it is a lot. But, um, you know. If you're interested in trying the game out, it's like the first sort of half an hour or maybe hour of story cutscenes. And then you get to wander around. Camarocho for a bit, do a couple of side stories. I said I didn't do the live chat. That is really fun. Like it's really funny. Um, uh, but uh, I'll let you discover that for yourself uh, if you want to. Otherwise, uh, that's going to do it. So from me, from Kiryu, from Camarocho, thanks very much for joining, and I'll uh, I'll catch you all later. Cheers.